Hey what's up guys, Jay here, and I got an After Effects tutorial again, so this is what we're going to be creating today. Okay, so you see, let's see right here, pause it. Um, everything except for what I want is blurry. And that is the blur effect. So, let's get started. Alright, so go to After Effects. I'm just going to close this real fast. Um, import your footage. I'm going to use the same clip. Put it in your composition type doohickey. And we're going to go to right click down here and go to New. And then Adjustment Layer. Which is what I always do and encourage everyone else to do it too. And... I'm going to have to make a Twixter to make my blur effect look good. So I'm going to do that real fast. That's fine. Okay, good enough. So there's my Twixter, and now I'm going to create another adjustment layer. And as long as it's above this, then it'll all keep going towards this one. So what I'm going to do is go to Effect, and then Blur and Sharpen, and Gaussian Blur. And then you're going to want to go up high enough to where it's pretty damn blurry. So I think I'm just going to go to 10. And yeah, that looks good. And then make sure the this layer is clicked. And then click on your Pen Tool. And then to make this easier, you can use the G and H button. The H is the hand, and the G is back to the pen. So zoom in a little bit, maybe. Click on your hand. And to make this easier, you can turn off the blur for right now. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go all the way around it first. Or else it'll make the only thing blurry is, would be the gun. Okay, so I'm done with that. Now you're going to want to start going around it. Whatever object you want to make not blur, there's a big plane going around my house. So I don't really care if this is perfect or not, so I'm going to rush through this kind of... Alright, it's complete. Now I'm going to fit back. Now you turn it on, and everything except for that is blurry. Doesn't that look sweet? Yes, it does. And if you want to line it up with Twixter if you have it, then go back to your adjustment layer 1. And then go to your first keyframe. And then go back up to your layer 2. And then ma not masks, my bad. Effects, Gaussian Blur. And then you want to click keyframe on blurriness. Go one frame over. Make a new keyframe. And then go back to, to the first one and then click zero. So it's at zero. And then when the Twixter starts, it goes to ten. And then go back down to the Twixter. And then go to... Oh, that's it. There's no more keyframes. Well then, that's pretty much that. So that's the blur effect. I uh, hope you learned something, so thanks for watching, and I'll have more tutorials up, so leave a comment, you know, vid video response, um, yeah, so thanks for watching, peace!